we are in Alvdal and uh, this time I'm actually driving uh, my Tesla Model X without the trailer so I want to test something because you know uh, many people they are worried about the range in winter in like cold temperature uh, right now it is uh, minus 11 degrees Celsius and uh, that temperature will be more or less the same all the way back to uh, Elvidum. So we're going to drive to Elvidum and uh, the car has been heated up about half an hour ish. Yeah, around there. So it's not fully heated up yet, but uh, as you know, we will have some downhill on the way down there. And then that kind of compensates for you know the, the lack of fully heated car. Uh, so we'll see now how much the consumption is and then we can estimate based on that on how much range you can get on typically on a, a Model X in winter. Oh yes, so let's go then. We are in Elvidum now, and uh, the consumption, average consumption was 245, but you know, I think I, I will adjust the result to about 250 to compensate for that uh, elevation. There was almost no wind, uh, slight headwind in the beginning, and now slight tail, uh, like side wind, so no big deal. Um, and uh, the 90 pack that I have has about 80 kilowatt hour available, and that means this car can do 300 kilometers. Yes, in, in this temperature uh, in winter, minus 10 to 11 degrees Celsius. And uh, I guess with based on this, you can also assume how much range the other cars will do. But like the the smaller packs and also the non-performance, they will have slightly less uh, consumption. So they will actually do it uh, pretty similar to this car. And then of course, the bigger one, the 100 pack, uh, well, I haven't tested, but it also the results should be better for those, of course, because they have a bigger pack. So uh, yes, uh, I hope this was useful for you. So um, that's it then for now then. So talk to you guys later.